guys, Jess here, and welcome to Minecraft Diaries. Now, in the last episode, we had Lucinda move into town, and honestly, everyone was so scared because she made such a ruckus getting here that we thought Ocasus was attacking or something, and it was just like... What was that? It was really late at night too, like I think maybe about 5 a.m. in the morning or something. I have no idea. But anyway, she ended up coming into town. She put her little, she like magically teleported her little house here and she's been working there ever since. And today I'm not going to bother her because if you remember, her and Cowboy Chan got in a little fight and yeah, I don't want to get exploded. So I'm gonna leave her alone. In fact, not only am I going to leave Kawai Chan and Lucinda alone, I'm going to leave everyone else alone because today is going to be all about Malachi and Levin. I need to spend some time with them. I've been thinking about it and I've come up with a few ideas. Well, a few things that we could do together rather. But the biggest thing that I think that we can do is... Let me explain first off. You know that Levin and Malachi are getting so much older. They have their room. They have their beds. Levin's no longer in a crib. So... I was thinking something we could build together would be like a little tree house for them and that's what I want to do today. So I want to help them make a tree house and I'm thinking about putting it, I actually don't know where to put it, um, but yeah, so we're going to find a place to put it and then we're going to, you know, talk to Levin and Malachi, but, uh, so, oh, I, uh, did I sleep in? Uh, I, I, I think I did. Uh, Zoe, hey, uh, good morning, Afmal. I had breakfast ready if you'd like some. I left you a plate on the table. I guess I did sleep in. Oh my goodness. Uh, thanks, Zoe. But um, where's Levin and Malachi at? Ah, they're outside playing. Did you need to see them for something? Um, I, I I'm, I'm planning on building a treehouse with them. Oh, that's a wonderful idea. I'll let you have the day with them. That'll give me some time to work on my barrier magic skills. After watching Kawaii Chan and Lucinda go at it the other day, I've become inspired to improve my own magics. Oh, that's. That's awesome! You actually- yeah, you- You deserve a day off, Zoe. You- you really should ask me more often for days off. Oh, I don't mind, Afmile. I told you before, raising Levin and now Malachi is something that just gives me utter fulfillment, and I'm so happy you've allowed me to become a small part of your family. <laughs> oh, um, I wanted to let you know that Malachi was talking to Levin the other day about the ocean and how he likes looking at it, so maybe you might want to build their treehouse overlooking it? That, um, that's a wonderful idea, but honestly, Zoe, the trees around here aren't big at all. Like, they're really small, and I don't know how that's going to be. I mean, I could build a tree that big, but it's not going to look amazing. Hmm. Ah, I've got it. Stay here one moment. All right, yeah, I can do that. Mm -hmm. What do you got there, Zoe? Here, take this. Um, what is it? It's a sacred tree sapling. These are very rare and only found from my home in the forest of Yagrasil. It's one of the two that I have in reserves. Wait, one of two? Uh, Zoe, I can't accept this. It seems, it seems really important. No, really, it's fine. Take it. I left behind my life in the forest a long time ago. I need to move on. Seeing this tree grow in a new place will definitely make it feel like home. So, go on and take it. Aww. Oh, thank you, Zoe. It's not a problem. In order to make it grow instantly, you need to plant the sapling and surround it with water. Might want to bring a water bucket with you. <laughs> now go and have fun with Levin and Malachi. <laughs> Zoe, that's so nice of you. Thank you so much. Aww, she didn't have to do this. <laughs> All right, I'll take good care of the sapling, Zoe. Don't worry. All right, you guys stay here and keep Zoe company, okay? I'm gonna go and, uh, yeah, there they are. Levin and Malachi. All right, uh, wait, why are, Raven? Oh, please, 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 nothing crazy. Good afternoon, Athma. I have a message from the villager Cadenza. Would you like to read it? No, I hate getting ma- no, no, if it, no, it's from, if it's from Cadenza. Yes, I, of course, will read it. Uh, very well. Here you go. Dear Afmao, thank heavens you didn't stop by yesterday. I was feeling impossibly under the weather. I didn't even want to leave home. I was so sick. I know I had told you that I wanted you to come over, but I seriously want you to stay away right now. 
<laughs> I'm keeping my door locked tight so no one gets infected with my fever slash coughing slash just gross stuff. I made you as well as little Levin a surprise, but now I'm thinking of remaking it due to my sickness. Lady Irene knows I don't want this to spread. Anyway, just stay away for a few days, okay? I'm so sorry. But hey, at least you get to be in that fabulous dress for a while, huh? <laughs> Take care, Afmao. I hope to see you soon under better circumstances. With love, Cadenza. Uh, that's all she wrote. Poor human girl. At least she's looking out for her people. Anyway, I'm going to relax here for a while and sunbathe. Don't mind me. See ya. All right, yeah, you you do your thing, Raven. Um, I hope the construction isn't bothering you or your dragon kind over there in that little hill that you guys live in. So, yeah, um, I'll leave you alone and let you do your own thing. Levin, Malachi, I have a surprise. Oh, hey, mom, going to serve the village? I, nope. Today is all about you and Levin. R really? Yay! I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, oh, I have two options. So we can, we can, I can either make it really dramatic or I can make it, or I can make it just meh, but I want to make it really dramatic. We're going to make a tree house. <gasps> what? Really? Ah! I might die again. Oh, again. <laughs> I always wanted a tree house. Yee, let's go. I can't wait. <laughs> All right. Um, <laughs> 11. Why bother scream? Is spider on him? Like, so like, he's like. Like Zoe? <laughs> no, I got exciting news. We're going to make... Pause for effect. A tree house. Huh? But house is behind you. Why make tree house? Like squirrel? Wait, what? Huh? Uh, there, there might be squirrels, but no, no, no. Um, it's for playing in games and stuff. Games? Games? Love and love games! Tree, tree, tree! <laughs> okay, we are totally gonna do this. So you guys wait right here for me, and I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna go grab some building materials, so that way we don't have to worry about all, you know, gathering materials and that kind of stuff. Um, so let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, go grab those materials, and then, yeah, Zoe, I'm gonna have to run past you just a little bit right here. Um, so materials. I have, I, I really should give that back to Lawrence. Actually, maybe I should just get rid of it because I don't think he wants to be reminded of that. I think I'll do that. Or maybe I'll just bury it somewhere. I don't know. We'll figure it out. That, that's another story for another day. Um, okay. So, I have a lot of stuff. So, Zoe said that I'm going to need, um, maybe, uh, because I know that regularly, I have a lot of stuff. Wow, I've been gone such a long time. I forgot I had all this stuff. Um, I know that regularly you need, like, bone meal in order to grow plants and trees, so maybe she forgot to mention that or something? I don't know. Um, alright, so we have all that stuff. We need a crafting bench because we need one, of course. You can't make something without crafting benches. We're gonna need a door. Maybe two doors. You never know if you need two doors. Uh, let's see. Ladders. Ladders are something we're going to need. We can use carpenter uh, blocks because they just make things look nicer. I don't know if I want to make it out of birch wood planks or a, a, a cat. I, I always have a hard time pronouncing this. Acadia wood or spruce. There's just, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take, I'm going to take two of each. Dark oak wood, um, oak wood. Uh, just, let's just, let's just take everything and anything. And we need a sign to mark our place. We need some sticks, maybe. You never know when you can use a fence, for sure. Um, alright, so we're gonna put all this stuff inside of my big gray backpack. All the stuff that we need for, um, this. And maybe we do need to go out and get some more materials. Um, but for now, like, maybe, maybe I'll send Levin and Malachi out to go get a few materials so they can, so, because honestly, I kind of want to make the place a little bit more safer before I let them climb up in the tree, but we'll see. I wonder how big this tree's gonna get anyway. All right, so uh, thank you so much again, Zoe. I appreciate it. All right, so let's go ahead and go. Levin, Malachi, you guys ready to go? It looks like they're ready to go. All right, come on over here. Come on, you guys. You coming? There we go. All righty. Yeah! All right, so I think I have a good spot of where we can put the treehouse. Um, I was kind of looking at it earlier, and yeah, this would look nice right here, but honestly, I want them to have like their own little place where they can go and have like little adventures and stuff. Um, so let's go down this way, and oh, that's new. That's brand new. Where did that come from? I guess, I guess, uh, Brian, Dale, Dr. Doctor, and Brendan made that. What, what is that? Is that, is that for fishies? 
<gasps> is Flipper in there? Flipper! Or maybe he's at the bottom. I don't want to go in there with Levin and Malachi. Oh, wait, there's Flipper, right? Is that Flipper? Are you guys okay? Okay, alright. Ooh, they scared me there for a second. Um, is that you, Flipper? <gasps> that is Flipper! <laughs> awesome, awesome. Alright, so, um, let's see. Uh, ooh, a snail. Look, guys, it's a snail! Oh, it went away! Now it's back! Now it went away! Now it's back! Now, now, oh, yeah, now it went away! <laughs> Alright, I'm having a little bit too much fun with that. Alright, come on, you two. Let's go. Um, I don't want to get you guys wet, so let's just... Go through here. Be careful. Watch your heads. Be careful. All right. Let's go through here and we come up here. And yeah, this is the place. This is the place where I want to put the uh, put the lovely little treehouse we're gonna make here. All right. So you guys, you guys can come with me. Um, but I need to uh prep this area. And I don't know how big this is gonna get, so we're gonna have to stand back when we're ready. Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, what do we need to do here? Uh, oh yeah, that's right. We need to first, we need to put down the tr the tree. So let's put down the tree right there. And she said to surround it with, um, with, with water. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the crafting bench and the iron. Uh, we're gonna put this right here. Put this, there we go. We're gonna get two buckets. Two buckets. Da -da -da. And we can go fill these buckets up with water. Make an infinite water source. Because that would best benefit us here. Do this like that. Good thing I brought my... Da, da, da. And put this down. Put that down right here. And then we can dig our little area right around here. There we go. And now we just take from the middle. And put that in. Take from the middle. Put it in. Take from the middle. Put it in. Take from the middle. And then put it in. And let's even it out. I just I just can't stand when it's not even. There we go. And alrighty, it should be good to go. So let's go ahead and stand back. Come on, come over here, guys. Wow, that that's a tree. That's a tree. Uh, <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna be that big. Um. <laughs> I think we're gonna make it a little bit closer to the ground, the, the little treehouse I would like to make for you guys, but as a tree. Um, <laughs> so cool, I know, isn't it cool? Uh, this is amazing, Lev and I are so excited we're going to gather materials to help right now. Wait, 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 boys, wait, I, 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 <laughs> I have materials. <laughs> Oh, they're so excited. I don't, you know what? I don't blame them. If they want to get out of the materials and help out, that's perfectly fine. It's actually a better opportunity for me to be able to start the foundation of this tree before they get back. I, um, don't really want them to climb up the tree until it's, like, safe and secure for them to go up there. So, so, yeah. All right, so let's go ahead and, um, I really need some torches. I, I don't think I brought any torches. Uh, unless I have some in my other backpacks. Uh, let's see real quick. Uh, maybe in this one? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess I'm good. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's put this here. Okay. All right. So we're gonna need a door. Um, I think. All right. So we got we gotta make maybe like a ladder up here. So maybe if we dig inside or or chop our way inside, we'll be able to to make stuff like that. Um, we can put this here. We don't really need that. I don't need food just yet. Put that right there. And yeah, we'll keep the materials backpack here so we don't have to clutter up my inventory yet again. All right. Just put that there. Like that, and for symmetry, let's put it on the same one right around. Wait, where, where did it, where'd it go? It's right there. All right, let's put this right here. Let's put this one right here. I think they're on the same. Yep, there they are. All right, so now we have the tedious task of digging into this and um, chopping out all the. Never mind. I spoke too soon. <laughs> that's maybe that's what the water was for to keep this like. Oh, it's all the way up there too. Nice. All right, awesome. This is perfect. I don't have to worry about um like having to hollow this out. It's pretty much already done for me. Okay. Um, next thing is like making a stairway up there that um is safe for the kids. So let's make it out of birchwood stairs. Cause why not? We we got it. So let's let's use it. Um. Alright, so maybe what we'll do is, I'll use the dirt as like a foundation, 
We'll do it up here like this. Put it like that. Um, like this. And then like, like that, I guess. And then we'll do it again. So we'll put the dirt here, put that there. More dirt here. The, the dirt is not gonna stay there. It's just like, hey, we, we, we need to to make this work. So let's let's make this work. And then we'll we'll do the dirt again. So so just keep doing more dirt until we get to the top. So we'll just keep repeating this. <laughs> this shouldn't take too long. This shouldn't take too long at all. Well, this is taking way longer than I expected. Alright, um, let's see. I think what we'll do is that looks like a perfect place to put the base of the treehouse. All right, yeah, we got this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do it like this. Um, we'll do it. We'll do it one more up. There we go. So like that, like this. There we go. Perfect. 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 Uh, now we're gonna take this out and we're gonna put some lights down. So let's go ahead and do that. So I've already made a bit of a little mark here, as you can see. Got this nice little pattern going. Um, I don't think that I have enough. Um, birch regular maybe I could just do this instead there we go yeah just upside down stairs so we'll do that and then what we'll do is we'll put that right there there we go awesome and then we'll just keep putting like upside down stairs is like right there is to kind of just make it look nicer I guess like we could do something like that so it's, it's not too cluttered you know not too um, empty yeah there we go Maybe just something like, no, no, that's not going to work right there. But we can do at least the other one. Okay, cool, cool. All right, so now we got something nice going. Um, Let us just make this again look nice. Make this, because I don't want dirt to be there. It just doesn't look nice at all. Let's put that there. And then dirt, no dirt, go away. No dirt, no dirting. There we go. And then one more right here. Wait, no, why did you do that? No, the symmetry is all. Okay. No, why am I using a pickaxe to, to do that? That's That was silly. That was really silly of me. Put that right there. Perfect. All right, yes. Now we just need some um, torches. So let's uh, put a torch right in the middle of each one. That way as you're going up, you can have like a nicely lit area. Maybe we'll put like a little fence pole in the middle so that way nobody falls down these stairs. I don't want that to happen at all, please. No, that's like my worst nightmare ever. Okay, uh, more wood. Now, what are we gonna make this out of? Let's make it out of... Acacia wood. What? Acadia, whatever it's called. Acadia wood. Let's make it out of that. Got all this wood here. Make another crafting table because we should make a crafting table. There we go. Like that. Now, we're going to chop this down. I think I might change the color of the wood, actually. Maybe it's a little too bright. I can't tell, but we'll, 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 we'll go with it as, a, as we go along. So let's chop this down. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Now let's bring this like that. Like this right here. Bring this down. Doop, doop, doop. Put that down. Just make a nice, safe, tiny treehouse for the boys. Um, and, you know, maybe this is something good for them because let's say that you know, Irene forbid that that Ocasus does end up um, trying to, you know, attack Phoenix Drop. Maybe they can just come up here and cut off the, uh, you know, the the stairway up here. And I think I would be perfectly fine with them doing that. Um, so yeah, that's just kind of like a a nice little play area slash defense mechanism if they if they need to to do that. So yeah, just hopefully it never even comes to that. All right, small little tree house. Let's let's continue building. So I believe this place is already looking really spiffy. I mean, I don't want to make it stand out too much in the tree because if it does, then people will be able to see them and you know, I kind of just want it so that way they'll be able to, you know, stay in here and have like a secret place and maybe what we'll do is we'll make it looks natural but we'll put like more secret like ways to get out of the tree and stuff oops i forgot to grab that there we go um now let's go ahead and make you know i have i know i already have sticks in my in, you know i just pull the sticks out of my um out of my backpack let's just let's just pull the sticks out of here uh there we go there's some sticks and do i have a fence I forget if I have a fence. I'm gonna need some fences so I can just, you know, I don't want anybody to fall off this. That's my 
biggest fear. Seriously, I don't want Levin or Malachi to just fall. I mean, I know Malachi can fly because the ghost and everything, but, you know, still, I just don't want him to think that I'm comfortable with them looking over the edge or something like that. Okay, so there is that. Um, we can make a little, um, put this right here. We can make like a little gate so you can get in. There you go. Little gate right there. And then we can just, you know, make a border around here so that way nobody falls off. There we go. And, oh, hey, Garth, what are you? Uh-oh. Oh, oh, no. I, um, I put my, uh, Garth, one second. Hold on. Wait. Wait, wait. Ah! <sighs> Garth, thank you so much. Oh, my gosh. L -l Lady Afma, are you okay? What were you doing up there? Where did that tree come from? Like, might as well explain everything to you. I see. Well, be careful next time. I'm sorry. I know I might have distracted you. Glad you didn't take the boys up there. I... I'm glad I didn't either. Thank you so much, Garth. <laughs> well, it was my pleasure. Um, say, it looks like you're done up there. Uh, oh, there are the boys. Wait, where? Oh! Oh! Levin! Malachi! <laughs> oh, wow, are you okay? So glad Garth caught you. Say, Mom, do you think we can go up into the treehouse and play now? Is it done? I want to see it. <laughs> Please? Sure. <laughs> of course. You okay? Garth's so cool. Can't we play? Yes, we can play. Come on. Let's go ahead and head up up there. You too, Garth. Come on. <laughs> this has been really fun. <laughs> uh, <laughs> This is nice, but I think it's bedtime for these two. I think so as well. Malachi? Yep. Levin? Yep. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and put the toys there. You can play with them for a little bit, Garth. I'm gonna go talk to myself. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to this episode of Minecraft Diaries. I hope you all enjoyed it as I did. I absolutely enjoyed building Levin and Malachi, Levin and Malachi, an adorable little treehouse where they can come and have little adventures and play, and I hope they really enjoy it. I sincerely do. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning into this episode of Minecraft Diaries. I look forward to seeing you all next time, and until then, take care. Bye bye I gotta put these two to bed. Come on, you two. Time for bed. Let's go.